house of Mystic Root Farms. And um, so yeah, just tell us what your farm is about, what kind of products you make, um, maybe like a little philosophy behind it, how you got started. Um, cool. All that stuff. Gotcha. Yeah, so we're Mystic Roots Farm. We are primarily medicinal herb farm. So that's the, I'd say, 90% of our time is spent growing medicinal herbs. Um, we have a bit, we do a bit of edible flowers and microgreens as well. We're regenerative, organic, certified naturally grown, no-till. Um, we do everything by hand. We like to joke around the farm that we do everything the long and hard way. Um, <laughs> we're really trying to be um, part of a growing number of small-scale organic herb farms here in the United States to increase access to high-quality herbal medicine. A lot of our herbal medicine, dried herbal medicine, is coming from overseas mm -hmm. with questionable processing and handling yeah. and quality control measures and getting, as an herbalist, access like accessing high quality medicine was a challenge for me. Definitely. So that was a big Definitely. motivation in kind of starting to grow more medicinal herbs. And I think one of our most unique philosophies here is we're really trying to expand the concept of what medicine is from not only the stuff we're putting in our bodies to treat whatever ails that we might have, but the food, food as medicine, so functional foods, um, medicine for our eyes, the beauty of nature. I saw those Spending bundles. time in nature and beautiful spaces, yes. um, eating it, putting it on our bodies, all kinds of medicine. Medicine is everywhere. Nobody can ever take plant medicine away from us, so we're just trying to be a vessel <laughs> of that and out into the world. Awesome. Yeah. So, um, is there a... Um, like a specific product that um, you want to like sort of show off today or um, um, We are, you caught us at our first time actually debuting our product. Oh, sweet. <laughs> yeah. We've only been in our for about two years now. So last year we spent all year growing and this year we're actually getting into formulating some products. So our, um, we're starting with a small line of herbal teas and herbal elixirs. Um, my, probably my favorite thing that we're doing right now is tea just because I'm such a tea drinker and you know, they're really fun to make. Yeah, yeah. They're fun to blend for a purpose and they're fun to blend for flavor. And I think that's important, getting flavor and um, some function in there. So what are your um, what are your tea flavors? So right now today we have the um, Better Days, which was blended for immune support. Do you want to try some? Um, yeah, what's, what's it? What do we have? It's um, Tulsi, Goldenrod, Lemongrass, Mullen, Peppermint, Yarrow, and Sage. Wow. It's all stuff that we grew on the farm and or wildcrafted on the farm. Yeah. Um, so all under the regenerative organic no-till kind of lens there. It's a bit savory with the sage and the yarrow in there. Um, that, yeah. Yeah. A little kick. I, yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't say no. that's a kick, no, but... I love it. I love savory teas. I'm not a huge sweet tea person or like a fruity tea person. Um, and then we have another. Um, I know. I I, mean, I really like. We have another. It's more of like a wildflower oh blend my gosh, that's meant to be it smells so good. Calming, anise hyssop and chamomile, marigold, blue corn flowers. And it's um, so colorful. Yeah, it's beautiful. Wow. I love the flowers. I definitely. If I had to pick a signature move in plants, it's adding color and edible flowers to everything I can. <laughs> why make it, why make it boring? Yeah. Right? Awesome. Um, so, if someone wanted to contact you and, um, you know, purchase some of your products, how would they do that? Yeah. So, our website is mysticrootsfarm.com and we're on both of the socials, Instagram and Facebook at Mystic Roots Farm. I think that's primarily it. All right. Yeah. Get awesome. on our email list. We send some pretty cool stuff out there. Well, thank so, you. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> thank you.